We searched for probably two years before we found this. We wanted a place that had lots of trees and we were able to grow our own hay and for our horses and things like that. So it, uh, it's just delightful every morning to wake up here and see what the weather brings. Seeing the, the smoke on the top of the mountain was not a good feeling. Well, I was frightened, of course, because we thought we would lose everything. But we were very lucky. We did not lose our house. We did not lose our barn. The fire burned to 100 feet of the house. We lost about 25% of the forest. It's unfortunate we have a beautiful forest up there, a bristlecone pine and ponderosa, and they all burned. We explored other avenues. We hired some of our own experts to come out and look at things because we wanted to see kind of what was going to happen and where it would go. I think the thing that really convinced us to begin working with FEMA is when FEMA worked out their agreement with NRCS. So we immediately had NRCS come out here and do an assessment. And they were very helpful. They, we walked the whole property with them from the top of the mountain to the river. When we went to the first advocate meeting, we felt so good coming home after that meeting. It was like, there's somebody there that will get us through this process. And now we have the ability to reforest and plant grass. Hopefully the elk will come back and eat that grass once we get it planted.